Greetings, everyone, and welcome to a stream that I have been looking forward to doing for a very long time. We're going to play some Kingsfield. Now, this isn't just Kingsfield. This is... This is more specifically the original Kingsfield. See, America got three Kingsfield games. Kingsfield, Kingsfield 2, and Kingsfield, I think it's called The Ancient City. However, what we did not realize until later is that there was a Kingsfield that came out before all those. America's Kingsfield is Japan's Kingsfield 2. America's Kingsfield 2 is Japan's Kingsfield 3, and Ancient City is Kingsfield 4, so we never got the first Kingsfield. This is the first Kingsfield. You can see at the top of the screen it says PSIO. I am running Kingsfield through an SD card, but that's because it's translated. We have a fan translation, and I am playing it on an actual PS1. So we're going to play the series that apparently has some sort of connection to the Souls universe, and I'm excited. Let's launch the game. Yeah, Dragon Ace, I suppose you could say it's like Clock Tower, where there's, uh, the numbering system is different in each country. At least they eventually worked their way back to, uh, Clock Tower 3 being Clock Tower 3 in both regions. <laughs> the words Kingsfield just right there. It reminds me of Doom 64. The arena is just Doom 64, the title. But enough of that music, I guess. That music? Am I playing freaking Castlevania right now? Yeah, not 1995. 1994. America did not get this. There, look at this. <clears throat> there was a small country called Verdite, 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 surrounded by a deep forest, encircled by fog and whirling winds. In ancient days, when a great battle was fought and many were dying, Verdite was saved by a person who then disappeared into the forest. Only the forest drifting fog knew who this person was. The citizens called their savior the dragon of the forest and built a sanctuary in honor of this person there. Eventually, only a legend remained, and the sanctuary was changed to the royal graveyard, and all was silent. But the legend says someday the dragon of the forest shall return bearing magical artifacts. However, the time has not yet come, and the sanctuary sleeps deeply. That scrolled a little faster than I was expecting, I'm sorry. All of a sudden I'm like, oh, I can't keep up. <laughs> Listen to this moody organ music. Loading. Oh, fuck if I'm Verdite, perhaps? Sure, let's go with that. <laughs> And we're in. We're playing, right now. This is just how it starts. If it, if it looked like I teleported here, that's because I did. And we're not going back. We're in. We're in it to win it, ladies and gentlemen. Now, you may remember that a while ago I streamed Eternal Ring, also made by From Software. That's like the evolution of this. So if you like Eternal Ring, but with worse graphics, then oh boy, this is the game for you. So left and right on the D-pad, turn, forward and back, move, forward and back. Strafing? Why you use the sticks, of course, just kidding. Not only does even Eternal Ring not use the damn sticks, but some PS1 controllers don't even have them at all. So instead, L1, R1. Oh, and here's the best part. How do you look up and down with no sticks? L2, R2. Oh boy, so that's going to be our gameplay. It's Eternal Ring Controls. Now, I can press square. I, I tested this game for a few minutes before to see if this is streamable. Square shoots a little light beam, more of a light projectile, but it costs magic. You can see my magic meter on the upper part of the screen, along with power. So I'm not going to press that. Select. I think select and X do the same thing. Yeah, 
That's it. So let's just say X. X. So experience, zero. Level, one. Class, soldier. Who the hell am I? I don't know. I think maybe the instruction manual lets you know who my character is because the game sure doesn't, but people online seem to know who I am. I think I might be looking for my father? So use item. I have one medicinal herb. I actually didn't realize that. Magic. What? Just pressing the control for the d-pad just took me out of it? Alright. Equipment. I have a short sword and my magic is light needle. So weapon. Short sword. Graphics. Magic. Light needle. A needle of light is launched damaging an enemy. Costs 2 MP. I could show you real quick in combat. Shield? I don't think I have anything. Head? Yeah, I don't think I came with any armor. What a jackass. Like, I'm going to this dungeon with nothing. <laughs> like, I found a sword. Alright, it's fine. Other... Yeah, I got a lot of nothing. I mean, I did just turn the game on. Status. So attack. Slash, chop, stab. There's magic. There's defense. I guess more on this later. And I only have 30 HP and 20 MP. We're very basic right now. Drop item? I don't want to. System. It's kind of cool that I can load whenever I want, but saving, as is the case with Eternal Ring, is done at save points. Yeah, right, Enthesius. You know it's quality when you can count the jaggies on the sword blade. Yeah, you're not kidding. Jeez, Fakafon. You're looking for your dad is Quest 64. There's an esoteric reference to make. Options. I could turn things that help me off. I won't do that. Also, I gotta get used to this, by the way. I messed that up because I meant for circle to be back, but this is Japanese, so circle is confirm and X is back. Also, pressing start, you have to hold the button down. Pause! Pause! Ah! Okay, so... Oh, I didn't show you the best part. Circle looks around and... Or, well, observes and talks to people if there are people, but attack? Oh, you're, you're not ready for attack. Oh, boy. It's an old video game. Hmm. Can I swing when I'm halfway recovered? I can. Interesting. Just less power. Alright. Also, map? What's that? What are you, crazy? At least I have a compass. Groundskeeper's room. Ozzy. Ran Valgv? Well, it's the groundskeeper's room. Alright, let's go. Video games. Graphics. Oh god, the flicker from all the little white specks. Oh, look at this. It's a fireplace. Will that hurt me? I don't know. Empty. So I could search barrels. When I first tried playing this game, I tried slashing them, so nothing really seemed to happen. I didn't know that was a thing, but... Okay, I'm gonna follow the rooms. I love that this implies that somebody just lives here. Like, what the hell? Nothing important. Nothing important! Nothing important! Alright, moving on. A mysterious dead end. But wait. I can just walk right through. I actually was meaning to search the wall, but it's just a fake wall. Also, there's a spooky skeleton who'll probably kick my ass, and I'm actually afraid to go in there in case he's right there. Oh, God. <laughs> That's a little intimidating. Can you come out to me? Because according to a guide I'm using, it says that he's way outside my level. Like, I'm not ready for this guy. Oh, God. <laughs> That's so intimidating. He's just chilling. Hey, he's got a spider shield. Are you kidding me? Like from Dark Souls 1? I hit him. There's my light spell. Oh god, this is actually scary. Because he's probably going to kick my ass. Ugh. Janky controls, man. See, that's my idea. My attack is so slow that I plan to... Oh god. I plan to run into him. Oh, wow! He could two-shot me. I get the feeling I'm not going to survive this, uh, this first attempt. 
And that's a game, ladies and gentlemen. I did it. I did it. And new game. <laughs> Goodness gracious. This is very much like Demons of Dark Souls, where like the first enemy in the game is way outside your level. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Ah, first try every time. Uh, wow. You know what? Maybe I'll just go for the item. I thought I could get cute, but I'm just gonna... Well, you know what? No. I'll give this one more shot with the light spell. I really shouldn't be draining all my magic right now, but I don't plan on much using it for other enemies because I've given a little bit of exploration a shot off camera. So I'll, I'll hazard light spells, and if that doesn't work... Then I'll just get the damn chest and leave. How does that sound? I can hit him! I am hitting him! If I can kill him, that'd be great. I'll have to recover magic elsewhere. Because I can't just do it on my own, unfortunately. Jesus Christ, dude. He just like... And there goes all my progress. I'm, I'm about to die. It's fine. Ooh, ooh. The, like, come on. This is such a dick move. Nope, didn't do it. Alright, I'm going to get the item and skip the skeleton. I'm not in the mood for this. Uh, well, okay. Yeah, and as uh, Fakafan mentioned, I, I don't know why the skeleton's not just walking through the wall. I was kind of hoping he'd do that because it's pretty claustrophobic in there, but oh well. So a full arsenal of, uh, or salvo of light didn't do it. So I guess I'll just get the damn chest and, oh, oh, oh my god. I tried sneaking by him. This is a great stream. This is probably my favorite stream. Uh, Fakafan, is this better or worse than Stonekeep? Uh, OG Stonekeep, I'm gonna say worse. Uh, based on my experience with an overpowered enemy. But, Stonekeep Bones of the Ancestors, just about everything's better. I really should do original Stonekeep at some point. That game is solid. It really is. Actually, wait a minute. I could stun him briefly with a light spell, right? Oh! A small shield. Okay. No. I don't know where he is. Ow. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Jesus Christ, dude. I want that shield. Also, how do I use a shield? Or does it just boost my defense? Do I? Like, I don't know if there's a defense button. So I don't know. Also, by the way, does Ozzy have a creepy skeleton in his closet, or is Ozzy the skeleton? Place your bets, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, go for broke. Uh, wow, that could not have gone better. Alright, so... Uh, equipment. Shield. Okay... But, like, again, do, do I use it? How does that work? Or does my defense just up now? I don't know. My goofy-ass gray arm. I don't know. Well, the important thing is that I got the shield. So, that was fun. I did it. First try every time. I don't have the guts to fight the skeleton, but that's okay. The skeleton doesn't have any guts. Let's go back out. I got my shield. I'm clearly an expert player. You've seen my expert playstyle. Turning around is so painfully slow, though. It's brutal. Now, which way am I going? Do I go in here? It looks like this might be a dead end, actually. No. Oh, this is just a dead end. I'll take it. Empty. Empty. This isn't going very well. Speaking of well. 
Can't really do anything with it. Empty. Uh, oh! Really? I was actually wondering if it would just say that for every item in the game, but nope, we got a medicinal herb. Speaking of which, I forgot. I could totally heal with the with the herb when fighting the skeleton. But he hits so hard, it's kind of not worth it. What the hell was that? I guess I'm just hearing the skeleton take, like, shadow boxing. Alright. You like that fog of war here? Oh, hello. He is dead. Oh my god, I have no idea where I'm going. I might have even wanted to go into that tunnel. Unless this is where I want to go. Have fun making a map of this game. Do you think this is the way I want to go? I don't see any enemies, I see graves. He is dead. Gravestone. 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 Doing it. Just like the Souls games, everything sucks. Also, wait, did I just come full circle? I think I did, actually. What? Oh, okay. There's no fanfare, it's just like, beep. Alright, fine. Yeah, this is definitely where I came from, so, okay. I guess I'll go in here. Oh, a mummy? Excuse me? I've never seen this enemy before. Oops. This guy has got HP. I'm actually a little nervous, because when I was playing this game off camera, the enemies I killed went down pretty easily. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with this- Oh god. I don't know what's going on with this guy. Gravestones almost got me in trouble. <laughs> what a moody game though. So minimalistic. What, Dude, why won't you die again? Is this for real? Thank you, jeez. What? Whoa, what? Okay, he is dead. Eight gold. A knight sword? Are you kidding me? I didn't, all right. I wish it would tell me the stats or something, but I'll go with that. Yo, everything's coming up, Lotus Prince. All right. Oh yeah, and good call, Dragon Ace. This is a delayed response, but my defense for slash attacks went up by two. So does my attack work any differently now? Is it faster? I mm. Alright, well. So which way did I come from? I, I ran around in circles fighting the mummy. I guess this is a dead end. Surprise. He is dead. Empty. Okay, there's just nothing here. Freaking mummy. Like, what is... Alright. And we're back, I guess. I don't know where I'm going. It's fine. Oh no, that's where I came from. I know that. So let's go this way. Graveyard Church. Priest. Juids. Cross. Am I going the right way? Because I get the feeling I'm... Wow. I get the feeling I'm not.
Well, here's the church. And here's an actual living human? With no face? My golden cross has been stolen. As a priest, my blessed cross is worth more than my life. Could you look for it and return it to me? Oh, what a blight this is. Yeah, I think that's going to be one of my primary goals of this floor. I know that this game has five floors, and the fifth is pretty much the final boss. So, I guess it's not this golden cross. Oh, it's a save point! Also, yeah, apparently formatting just formats your memory card. Like, are you goddamn kidding me with this? <laughs> Alright, so let's save. Insufficient free space? Oh, no. Oh, no. Do... Ooh. Do I have another memory card? You know what? I'm gonna go look for one. Well, that was cripplingly awkward. So, you know what? I don't think I found another memory card, but... Pretty much everything I would want to play on the PlayStation 1, I would do on the PlayStation 3 anyway. So I'm actually going to just format the damn thing. <laughs> I hope that worked. I don't know if that did it right. Oh no, I pressed X. Yeah. Feels bad, man. Oh, that took no time at all. So, hey, I know. Let's save. Did it. I hope I didn't ruin everything horribly, but oh well. So I think I'm at the wrong save point though because I was expecting to find a shop. So I'm just somewhere else. I guess I'll look around. Unless this is where I want to be? I don't know. Are you a shop, even though you don't look like it? Oh, whoops. Oh? Aren't you the commander's son, John? There you go. I can't begin to tell you how much the commander has helped me. I'd like to help you too somehow, but I just sold my graveyard map to a suspicious parent and his child a few minutes ago. Damn. I missed it by just a few minutes. Empty. I can't even loot your stuff. Because you don't have stuff to loot. So apparently the crosses are the save points. I didn't realize that. Oh well. Back out into the dangers. I have no idea where I'm going. <gasps> Commoner's graveyard. Can I... Locked. The wall is locked, ladies and gentlemen. Boy, oh boy, this is awkward. Does anybody know where the light shop is? I could, I, I could sure go for a light shop on account of having 158 gold. I have no idea where I'm going. There are stairs, I guess. Where am I? Light Company. Oh, I found it. Sales and purchase of weapons and armor. Wilfred Light. Oh my goodness, I found the light shop. So there ought to be a safe point around here somewhere, right? The chest is locked. Welcome to Light's Shop. You can't put up a good fight without proper equipment. I offer fine wares at reasonable prices. What can I buy? Antidote herb. Yes, poison is a thing. Recovery medicine. Does that just heal a bunch? Dragon tree fruit is extremely expensive, but I believe that is full heal for HP and MP. Short sword, I have that. Battle axe, damn. Night sword I have, and it's expensive, so I'm glad I have that. Iron mask, damn, look at that. Night helm, that is expensive. Oh boy. <laughs> Night plate, oof, I can't afford anything, man. Small shields, 
Night Shield, Gauntlets, Iron Boots. This stuff all sounds pretty cool, but I can't afford it. Does my short sword seriously sell for 150? That's, wow, this is one of the more reasonable prices. Like, this this is very reasonable as far as uh, RPG merchants are concerned. Usually they buy back at like two-thirds the price or something, but 150 to 180, that's decent. But I'll, I'll hold off for now, although I actually quite like this, this shop. And I think there are two shops on this floor, I just don't know where the other one is. Or what it is. <clears throat> I wonder how much of an inventory difference there is. Royal Barracks, Royal Guard, and Darius Knights Division. Commander, Hauser Forrester. This is Hauser. So let's uh, barrel it up. Let's, there's no way the beds work. Are you kidding me? Okay. Ugh, they don't tell you anything. So is there more? Nothing important. I can't believe there's just a free medicine sitting there. There's a guy in the barracks. Are you kidding? Oh, and there's a save point. Hello. All right, now we're talking. Uh... Why is nothing happening? I hope my game didn't crash. If it did, then it's a goddamn good thing I just saved. Huh. I think my game might have crashed. It's a damn good thing I just saved. I'm gonna reset and hope I don't kill the stream. You know, is it just me, or do I have to start a new game to load a game. That kind of seems like a dick move. That's that's really awkward, but all right, let's see if that save works okay. All right, so we're back at the church. That worked okay, but am I allowed to save in the other place you're the janitor person you did not help me I go out here I guess now which way did I go did I just keep going down the tunnel oh this is the commoner's graveyard that's right yeah, let's see if I can work with that other save point, because that... Yeah, and they see it might be worth doing rolling saves, just so long as I'm allowed to overwrite anything, ever. Because I don't know right now. That makes me nervous. Also, it would really suck to grind and then just, like, nope. Game crashes when you try saving. Did I go in here, or did I keep going? I already forgot where I went. I think I did go in here. I wanted to go to the light shop. So, here's the light shop. There's the beds. Got the medicine. Go here. Here's the save point. Area two. Let's do it. Saved. Area one. Yeah, it worked. It was just a scary crash before. So I don't know what the hell that was. But we're golden. Oh, a nerve. Okay. Here's a guy kneeling over at the fire. I'm Bosk Kris, a military guard. These are our barracks, but the commander and his men went to the lower floors and ordered me to remain here. I haven't heard from them in a while. Okay, so now we've gotten slight more 
exposition. So let's see if I can't figure out... Because I'm, I'm using a guide for everything because this game is really difficult to navigate at all. So... Where do I want to go? I got the save point and everything. Okay. So that's cool. As I get back to the main part of the tunnel, so I'll have to do that. And I don't know what this is, if anything. Just a, a nook. Okay. Let's get out of here. There. Now it says, as you get to the main part of the tunnel, directly across from the entrance to the save shop. Uh-huh. Moving on. That might be it. Nothing with the walls. So it says... Continue to hug that left wall and head deeper into the tunnel. This is just playing a dead end, so let's keep going. There are pits that can hurt me. Yeah, this is what I remember. This is more like it. But now I have a knight sword, not a short sword. What a creepy enemy. Crap. An antidote herb. Beautiful. And five bucks. I'll take it, baby. It did say the next left-handed alcove, though. Let me just make sure there was nothing in that alcove I just came out of. Oops. Well, I fell in the pit, but... It was benign, I guess. Yeah, there's nothing in here. Alright, let's move on. There are some pits that can, like, have spikes or poison. So I gotta, I'm gonna have to watch out for those. This is, like, my warning pit. Like, there will be pits. Whoa, that's new. Well, okay. Creepy. Like, actually creepy. Ugh. Time to play the stun lock game. Just give me a look with that creepy eye. Stun lock, baby. Oh, that hurt. Okay. I have, like, no HP, so even crappy medicinal herbs are, are all I need at this early stage of the game. Yeah, you better run. To hell. Ugh. Creepy. Scorpion. Oh, nice try, Kingsfield. They do appear to be restricted to their respective alcoves, but I don't know. And these guys can these guys can poison. I I, I actually don't want to deal with that. A bloodstone. Apparently these things have actual effects in later Kingsfield games. Some kind of restorative. Yeah, Fakafan and Axe probably is good against the tree. Like Final Fantasy missed the quest. Um but I, I think bloodstones are just useless in this game, so I can sell them for a bunch of money. Good for me. I found a bloodstone off of a skeleton. Well, good. This also means I'm going the right way with the guide. The second alcove has an item I actually require, and it's not the cross, but I still require it. Oh, that slow down. Ugh. Makes the squeak. I don't want to attract his friend. Okay, now we're good. Uh oh, oh, that was a 
was close. Level increases. Video games. Japanese. I saw another enemy past them. Ugh. Two gold. Whoa, hello. That's sound. Two shotted. Five gold. What the hell was that? Oh. Yeah, enemies can respawn behind you. Which the guide says makes this game feel kind of like Alien. Like the, the, the old video game. We're like, there, I cleared the room. No, you didn't. Hey, look, it's another corpse. Welcome to Dark Souls. Dragon Cup. I believe I actually require this. So that's nice. The hell was that? Whatever it was, it wasn't immediately around me. Scholar's Bones. Oh, I can investigate the corpse? The water of the fountain has withered because I took the cup from the temple. Someone please return the cup to the dragon's temple. Yeah, I actually need this. I apparently there are three goals on this floor and I just completed, well, I just got a key item for one of them. The funny thing is, as I advance in this game, all of a sudden this part of the dungeon is going to look like such a joke. But right now, anything is scary. Also, I kind of like that because I leveled up. Like, you could see that my HP and MP are no longer maxed because I have a higher max. Okay. I gambled a little too much. I love my goofy-ass arm. Okay. The freaking, like, PS1 AI is playing footsies with me. This is ridiculous. I see the scorpion has played fighting games before. I was hoping I could at least three shot the guy. There we go. Three go. Oh wow. But there's there's an item I want. Not not need, but want. Video games. RPGs. Somehow that didn't hit me. Time pressing triangle to the best of your ability. Okay. I don't want to get poisoned. Two gold, but wait. Skeleton, was that not the item I wanted? That sucks. I YOLO'd for nothing. And yes, as you can see, circle strafing is viable. It was freaking required in Eternal Ring. With those lizard men who, like, two-shot me, and they were fast as hell. That was ridiculous. Ugh, that extendo tail. Reminds me of the Hornet in Eternal Ring. Level increases. So was there really no item here? I was kind of hoping for an item. Skeleton. Wow, that was disappointing. But I got experience. Level increases. So, you know, this could not possibly have gone any better. Actually, for real, I haven't gotten hit by those guys. Whoa, oh, wow. That has to be the item I wanted. But wait, buddy. You didn't expect. Level increases. Get up in there and hack that tree. By the way... Apparently, there are two ways I can increase stats. One of them... Aha! One of them is to... Do these guys just not move? One of them is to... That's fine. Is to keep wailing on enemies. That'll increase my strength. To increase magic, I gotta keep using magic. That's enough of that. The thing with magic is... Ah, oh, God. 
they're, they're, it's limited, so I can't just press square forever. There. Happy to see you go. And they can turn around. I deserve that. I'm actually doing really badly now. Ugh. I gotta be a lot more cautious over that first tree. Just respond. Don't attack, respond. Counter attack. First try every time. 25 gold and... Breastplate, baby! Now we're talking, that's what I was looking for. Right now you can see that my slash is defense is two, chop stab is zero, but with the breastplate, Slash is four, and chop is two. Free breastplate, baby. I didn't have to go and buy at the shop. This is great. Um, yeah, and Bayes, yes, you make a good point. Few games don't have circle strafing as a legit strategy. Uh, you assume my class potentially changes based on which stats are better? Actually, yes, or at least my ranking, as far as I'm aware. Anyway... I got me uh, a free breastplate, so I'll head out the way I came, which I guess means I'll hug the right wall. And then all the way back toward the hallway with the columns. Oh, geez, so we're going back to, like, the beginning of the game. And we're going- oh, I don't want to go this way. Wait, wait, hold on, what's with the slowdown? I only see one scorpion. But this slowdown is for real. I three-shotted him, though. Didn't four-shot him, I three-shot at him. Ladies and gentlemen. So let's go... I guess this way? I hope. I think this way? If I hug the right wall, I think I'm doing it right. If I see a little pit, I'll know I'm going the right way. That kind of hurt. I think this guy... No, I'm thinking something else. Never mind. Level increases. One gold. Son, I am disappointed. I know I got the name wrong. It's fine. Ugh. I thought that would hit. Oh, dear. Ah, uh, that's enough. This is why going to the shop is a good thing. I'm kind of hoping, though, that enemies can drop more than just gold. Oh, wow. I think I am going the right way. Uh, whoops. That's where the first skeleton was. Although, actually... Were you the bloodstone guy? Skeleton. No, you were not. Scholar's Bones was the chalice. Oh, so this might have been the Bloodstone guy. Alright, again, I think I'm going the... What the hell? Oh, a spider. Not exactly Resident Evil, are you? Also disgusting. Oh, I thought that killed him. It did not. That's more like it. Five gold, baby. Now I think I'm probably going the wrong way, but I kind of want to explore this avenue. Maybe I am going the right way. There's the pit, right? And there's a free medicinal herb. Are you kidding me? I'll take it. But then there's another pit, so that's definitely the wrong way. Let's get out of here. Maybe I am going the wrong way. I don't freaking know anymore. No, this is the right way. I did it. This is what I wanted. That's intimidating. But if there's no enemy, this might be the fountain actually. There's a free antidote herb, free medicinal herb, recovery fountain. This might be it. I can't make heads or tails of that thing, I guess. Recovery fountain, yeah. What the hell was that? Just shadow boxing. Someone took a swipe at me, or thought they did. I'm just gonna move on now. Forget the fountain. 
Back to the gray tunnels where I don't know where I'm going. It's fine. I think I am going the right way, though. I would just like to see if I can hit up that, uh, that save point again. My kingdom for a save point. This game actually is kind of fascinating, though. But a map would be very, very much appreciated. I know that there are, like, drawings of maps available online. I might want to look into those. Church? Good enough. Church, light shop, I don't care. Either one is a save point. Area 3, please. That's the save for me. Boom. Did it. Area 1. Boom. Did it. Area 2. Alright. We're doing it, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yeah. Put the chalice on the shelf. It, it does make sense that I would put the chalice on the shelf, but I kind of thought that the game would just do it. But, alright, I'll head back out. Now, we had seen that hallway with the arrows that I couldn't go through, like right here. So, turn right and walk until I come up to a big hallway to my left. And then it says, walk to the end where there's a door in front of me that I cannot yet open. Okay. pretty long hallway. Ah, uh, yeah, this is what I played when I first did this off camera. Snakes. They were like the first enemies in the game I saw, and this slowdown is legendary because there's like five enemies on screen. So let's increase the game's efficiency, shall we? And these guys can poison. Oh, there's six snakes. Ugh. A snake just sounds like that. Circle straight, baby. I see the coin. This is a lot of snakes, jeez. But I'll take the medicinal herb for nothing. Yes, please. Not the most gold, but medicinal herbs are like 33 bucks. I am not poisoned, I got lucky. I am poisoned. Done. But this is why you gotta be super careful in this game. Poisoning really it's quite damaging. Like an eternal ring. If you're poisoned, it's rough. Alright. Strength increases. But that was just because I've been swinging a million times. So that's how that works. And again, if I use magic a million times, then magic will increase. Gravestone. Alright, so... Where was I going? Walk to the end where there's a door in front of me I can't open. Right. And then turn north and enter the tunnel. But I got caught up in this graveyard fight. It was a graveyard smash. Light family grave. Whoa, hold on. Actual different text? Gravestone. 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 So only one of these was the Light Family Grave. Gravestone? Oh, alright, hello! Okay. Damn. Good for selling. And then it says turn north. I hope this is where I'm supposed to go. And it says ignore the first left hand path. Freaking green creatures, man. I like being moderately le okay. I like being moderately leveled, though, and getting free items. But now, where am I? Enter the second left-hand path a ways down. Okay. I hope I'm going the right way. Oh, oh, hello.
Have you seen a young person who looks just like me around here? In fact, he's my son, but we had an argument and he ran off. Okay. So continue down the tunnel. All right. Side quests, Kingsfield, old video games. Slow down. Five gold. I hope I'm going the right way because this place is getting complicated. My strength increased, buddy, and my level increases right now. I, wow, I have no idea where I'm going. But this area looks unnatural. So I hope I'm doing this right. Go north immediately after leaving the tunnel and I'll find a save point. I hope. I hope this is the right way. Recovery medicine and bloodstone? Jeez, uh, this is great. And a medicine? Two? Three? Are you kidding me? Thank you, game. Unbelievable. I think I went the wrong way, but my god, that was worth it. That's incredible. And then I get greeted on my way out. Six gold, baby. But I still gotta find out where to go. Because I'm looking for an area with a save point, and I have no idea where I am now as compared to where I was with that guy digging through the grave. Ugh, a tree and a spider. <laughs> Face me. I think this is the wrong way. This looks like a dead end. But I get to beat up a tree. Already got him. You can tell I'm leveling. Is that a key? Maybe I do want to go here. I keep expecting a spider to have less HP. Light family key. Again. Are you kidding me? This is great. I just need to see what I can do with it. Because I, I was actually looking for something else. But I mean, I'll happily take this. I went the wrong way, but I accidentally went the right way. Ugh. Uh, whoa, scorpion. Chill out. The hell is this? Dragon Temple. I think that's the wrong way, but I'll sneak her in for a second. There's a pit. I'm looking for something else. Just like a ton of ring, it's all about when you press the attack button. It's timing. One gold from a scorpion? Come on, scorpion's as big as I am. Get the hell out of here. There we go. Now we're back to the... There's the grave robber guy. So maybe this is the way I want to go? I hope. At least I've reoriented myself, kind of. Okay. I should not have done that, but it worked anyway. Oh, he's not dead. Ow. But he didn't poison. Four gold, four gold. So many... Holes. That was stupid of me, but it worked. Three gold. No monster. Broken shovel. Thanks, video games. That didn't help me at all. Where am I? Oh. Commoner's grave. Again, we're, we're going somewhere here. Ugh, enemies are just endless. Which is actually kind of good. Because you can grind that way. Still, I'm not doing a good job of finding this guy's son. Unless he's around. Uh oh. 
This isn't the guy. Broken Sword? Broken Sword. Not to be confused with the video game of the same name. He is dead. Uh, well. I don't know where I'm going. Oh, what? We meet again, Sir Skellington. I really don't want to deal with that guy, though. It says, go north after leaving the tunnel, and I'll find a safe point. Which way is north? Don't come this way. Oh, I really didn't think he'd come this way. Oh, God. Oh, there's another. No way. No way. No way. Oh, wow. This is bad. I might be better prepared for skeletons now, but I don't want to have to find out. Aha! Uh -huh. Act oh, actually, wait. Let's just heal right now. Just to be sure. Oh, wow. Oh, thank God. Oh. I, I three-shotted him? Okay. I'm a little tougher than before. Oh no, is that the guy? That's a save point and a mummy. That's why I heard that. Arr. I'm stronger than before, buddy. Come on. Come on. This guy still has HP for days. It's ridiculous. There we go. 24 gold and... Got the map, baby. How do I check the map? How do I check the map? Equipment? Use map? Like, eh? Oh! <laughs> wow, dude. Oh, that is unfortunate. But I will save. I don't know why the game crashed that first time. That really scared me badly. But I'm playing it safe. Alright. So that that's that's a map. Video games. Maps and video games. Hans's body. Ah, oh, Hans, run! It's the... Mummy? Well, I, I got the map. So... Eh? So it says, Exploring the rest of the Northwest only leads to a door I can't open yet. Although I will want to. Head back out, past the guy digging up the dead, until I come to a five-way stop. But why? Where are we going? Um... No, I, okay, I do want to go this way anyway. Alright, let's go back. Head back out past... If I can find my way back to the, the digger guy, I hope I can. Yeah, I guess I'll try it. Have fun figuring this game out completely on your own, by the way. Even with a guide, I'm a little disoriented. And I don't just mean sense of direction, I mean like, just anything. This game, like the Souls games, is pretty minimalistic in terms of straight-up goals. You know, Dark Souls is like, ring the bell, and you're like, okay. And then you have to navigate, like, the entire dungeon. <laughs> Jesus. That was stupid of me, but it worked. There we go, let's... Oh, I deserved that. I wanted to get the gold and I wasn't even thinking about the giant scorpion right in front of me. That was also very stupid of me, but it worked. Alright, let's get back out. I don't know if the guy digging will... Say anything? Like, was that his son? I don't know. Oh, I'm talking to him. There was a map of this graveyard that I needed to find graves to loot. I mean, I needed to know where I should dig new graves. I think my son must have taken it. Yeah, I think his son's dead, and this guy himself is kind of scummy, so, like... 
Mm. So, head out until I come to a five-way stop. Past the Clueless Father. Is this the five-way stop? Actually, how does the map look if I use it? Am I... I am marked on the map. That's something. But I don't know what five-way stop means. This is a little... Uh, I want to go to the northeast leg of the tunnel to the Dragon Temple. Okay. Okay. Maybe this is the way? Really? A snake's just in here? Probably can one-shot no him. Yeah! I'm already powerful. What is my status anyway? Level 6. And my HP is 40 out of 55, but even 40 is higher than my max when I started. By the way, the max level in this game, I believe, is 48. So there's that. Where was that dragon temple, though? Am I going the right way? I'm not even sure if the dragon temple's where I actually want to go to. It's just, like, a point of reference. And clearly this is the wrong way, wherever it was. So that's that. I really should increase my magic, but I need to find a way to recover my magic. Like, if I, if I have a ready way to do that, then that's, that's a different story. Oh, get the hell out of here. I can one-shot those guys. That's great. Ah, now there's a poison pit. Don't touch that. Oh, this feels so good, though. Let's try to keep the eye on the snake, too. Oh, that did not kill him. I got greedy, Martin. One goal. All that for one goal. The snake had three and he was way easier to fight. So these are samples of pits you don't walk into. Poison, poison, and spikes. And spikes will do a ton of damage. And poison, poisons. What a revelation. I'll take that herb, though. I can two-shot spiders, who don't drop anything, thank you. More, spider. I think there's an area somewhere on floor one where there's just infinite spiders, so if you want to grind, that's how you do it. Oh, good, we got a tree up ahead. Antidote, thank you. That did not work. Somehow that did not hit me. I'm a I'm appreciative. I can four shot a tree. 36 gold. Be still my heart. Skeleton. He is dead. Not to be confused with a skeleton. I really don't think I'm going the right way, by the way. But I'm exploring. I can find stuff. One gold from a friggin' scorpion. Ah, oh, come on. Ooh, that was close. I love how my health looks low, and it's really not. Like, it's the same that it was before, but my max HP is just better. Broken sword. Where am I? I clearly went way off path. Oh, a chat. Okay, I'll heal to be safe. Hey, it didn't fully heal me. That shows how far I've come. Got 
Got him. For one gold. Jesus. But, there's a chest. I don't know if I could open it. Empty? Oh, that's a dick move. This place is riddled with traps for an empty chest. Thanks, game. Fame. I- oh man, I am way off right now. I have no idea where- Like, I clearly went the wrong way. I was supposed to go... Toward... The Dragon's Temple. That is... Way far away from here. Because that was back in that network of tunnels, but... We did some exploring. Skeleton. Let's get the hell out of here. Watch out for spiders, I guess. Or not. Oh. oh that, was, that was a bad shot. 18 gold from one spider. That's more like it. Four gold. Alright, I think we're going back to the proper tunnels now. It, it wasn't too bad to get here, I just need to find the Dragon's Temple. Where was that? This is most disorienting. Yeah, Anthasius, regarding the empty chest. Could be worse, could be a mimic. You are not kidding. I don't know if a game as old as Kingsfield is going to pull mimics, but oh boy. Yeah, that's the wrong way, so I definitely want to go left. This is a clunky map system, though. God forbid you have an auto map. Even original Doom allowed you to move while looking at the map. <laughs> Strength increases. I think that's for swinging and hitting something like a hundred times. Same with magic. Uh... Where was the temple? Could it be the upper left path? Or could it be the southwest? Ooh. I'll try northwest, I think. No guarantee of anything, though. Well, West? I don't know. Two gold, six gold, thank you. Oh, that was awful. I do not have high hopes of this being the temple, to be perfectly honest. Nope. Yeah, I'll just back off, I think. That was no good, but I can make this right. I hope. Back to the tunnels. I should have known the Dragon Temple is supposed to come off of the tunnels themselves. So let's go north if I can get away with it. I hope I'm doing it right. I'm still going north. Yeah, north and west, I'll try it. Who the hell knows? There's, yeah, there's you, I remember you. I did it, I'm back here. Excuse me. Fell in the pit, but it didn't matter. Oh, is this the dragon temple thing? Commoner's grave, damn it. I want the dragon temple though. How do I Dragon Temple? <sighs> so exploring the northwest area leads to a door I can't enter. Okay. So... Head out past the Clueless Father until I come to a five-way stop. I guess I'll try it. I'll just go back east. <laughs> this time I think I actually have to fight these guys. Like a two-shot scorpions, that's pretty cool. That 
That's because I was mashing attack without letting my power come back. Full power, I can two-shot these guys. Pass the father. Until I come to a five-way stop. Am I doing it right? Is this not, not sure if new path? No, it actually is. So do I fill out the map as I explore? I kind of assume that the map would be a physical piece of paper that would show the whole dungeon. There's the dragon temple. So take the northeast leg of the tunnel, a straight shot to the dragon temple. Okay. All right. Now I think I'm doing it right. Oh no, that's the problem. I'm I'm I'm, I'm off the map. Okay. No wonder I was so confused. But we're going to the dragon temple. This is the place where I was supposed to put the golden chalice down, I guess. Or is there just nothing in here? Or is there just... Oh. Okay. Here we go. So it was not by the fountain. This is where I used the cup. Although I guess I should do it from the menu. There. Now, what did that do? I'm not seeing much of a result, but according to the guide, it says the dragon spring has started to flow once again. So I got the light key. I already did that by accident before. So now I want to head back to the five way stop and go southeast. Uh, fair enough. I'll just work my way back. And I would like to get a save point, because I'm going to need to call it soon. Oh, thank you. Okay. Southeast. Can I still do that? I guess I... Or is it here? Eh? Ignore the first side tunnel I see on my left into the man-made room. So maybe I do want to go here? Nicholas Orman. Hans Orman. Oh, the father and son, and the son is totally dead. But this is where I've been already, right? Didn't this lead to a door I couldn't unlock? Or was there, a, was there a door here? I don't see any door. I don't know, man. I don't know. I do not know. Maybe I'll tackle this area after all. I am going southeast right now. Kind of. Not really. Spider. Yeah, this isn't really doing it for me. It's just an alcove. But I didn't see any door I couldn't open. So I don't even know. It said ignore the first side tunnel I see in my left and enter the man-made room. Unless this wasn't the southeast path from the five-way stop. That's the only thing I could think of offhand. Level increases, though. I'll head back to that five-way stop, I suppose. Dragon Temple. Oh, I'm facing northeast. That's my problem. Southwest. Right. So now that puts me back this way. But how do I go southeast? Do I just keep going straight until I get to that much bigger split? Perhaps here I go southeast? One loud snake. Ignore. 
ignore the branching path on my left. Eh? And go to the man-made area on my right. I don't know if I'm doing this right, though. Not sure if. Oh, yeah, I think I've been here before. Head east to my left. If I'm doing it right. I think I am. And hug the right wall, it says. <laughs> Actually, I don't know. Now I'm going to various tunnels. There's like a spider tunnel. So I don't know. It should you turn around me into the second shop. Yeah, I don't freaking know. But I'll try hugging the right wall because why the hell not? Oops. There we go. I'm hugging the right wall. I don't know where I'm going, it's fine. Oh, did I do it right? Oh, I did do it right. Gil's shop. I don't know if I could afford what I want from him though. 579, I don't think I can afford what I need. But if this guy has a save point, then I'll take that too. He does not. Still, here's Gil. I've got some rare items on sale. It's okay with me if you don't want to buy them, but you'll be better off if you do. That's the one. I need that gold cross. And I also would very much like this. Apparently this is a good way to grind for magic, this particular sword. I certainly want that. Um, Yeah, I can sell my short sword. It's not much, but I can sell something. Crescent Axe? Jeez. Great Helm? Breastplate I have. Full Plate? Holy. Fire Mail? Tower Shield? Leg Guards? Damn, dude. Sell. I could sell my Bloodstones. I like that it kicks me out every time I sell. This is actually going to help me a lot, though. I'm not quite there. Damn. 12 gold. Ah, I need to grind for gold, dude. That's the, like, and I, I really want that other sword, too, because apparently I can really get going once I get it. But I, I like, the gold cross, though, is required for the, for beating this level. I, I need to give it to that priest. But how am I going to get freaking 300 more gold? Like, how many enemies do I have to kill? Also, where am I on the map? Just so I can see. And I'm facing south. Okay. Oh yeah, this is that trap area with the, the dud chest. So I was standing right next to that shop the whole time and had no idea. That's kind of funny. But I am... No gold. I am super going to need uh, a save point in the relative near future. Just making sure that this is the way back to Gil's shop. Yes, it is. So Gil's shop is this location on the map, which is a little funky. But that's okay. I can, I can make that work. You please say... Kolishmard out loud is like I tried the, the name of that sword Kolichemard Kolishmard Broken Sword You sir Gold 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 oh, Are you kidding me? He just gives me a battle axe and 44 God damn that means I could sell one of my weapons. Just like that. Status. Attack. Slash three, chop two, stab one. All chop, little in the other ways. Interesting. I'll see what chop is like. That's a fast swing. And we're back here now. 
It just gives me a battle axe. That's freaking insane. Which means I also have uh, 1,493 gold. I'm getting to money. Yeah, Anthesius, yeah, I should keep both weapons just in case one's better than the other. The, the chop is probably wonderful against the trees. I can't speak for other enemies, though. I just want to try staying in this general area. Th that's the Gil shop. I want to try staying in this general area so I don't really lose track of where Gil's shop is. That's the thing. Even when you do everything in this game right, like, I need to grind just for money. It's kind of unfortunate. But that's a super chop stat. I hit him. Recovery on this weapon is a little on the weak side, I think. I still two shot him. Nothing. Although, I mean, experience isn't bad. The shadow on the wall made it look kind of like a door, I don't know. <clears throat> this is unfortunate. It really is tempting to sell the axe, but at the same time, I probably shouldn't do that until... West. I probably shouldn't do that until I get another one or something like that. I could use a couple hundred gold. And this was... is this a dead end? Is that a, Like, I can't tell if that's a door or what. No, it's a door, all right, and I can't go in. And apparently, even with the light key, that's no good. So if I want to get out of here, I'm going to have to go west or north. Left from where I'm standing. At least I'm slightly getting the hang of this. Yeah, Anthesius, there probably are weapon or enemies that are weak against particular attacks. I know that there are elemental weaknesses for magic. I should find more trees. <laughs> If I can. And now all of a sudden, no one's dropping any gold. This is not good. There's the guy. Still two shotting. That did not kill him. Four gold? Ugh. It's killing me by inches here. I, I do not want to go to the Dragon Temple. Because I, I did the one thing there was to do in that. I don't know. Uh, Fakafan, how do you do various attacks? You don't. <laughs> some weapons are chop, some weapons are slash. It's like Final Fantasy Mr. Quest. And this is a dead end. But hey, I am getting slightly familiar with the layout. A little bit. And I love how I haven't used any magic, but I'm at half capacity. Like, with level ups, I've been leveling up my magic. Yes, yeah, sword's better for these guys. You know what? Oh, thank you. You know what, though, for real? I'll put my knight sword back on. That recovery is way better. I'll put my knight sword back on. And if I see a tree... Dude, where's the damn gold? And if I see a tree, then I'll start chopping. Like, all of a sudden, no one's dropping gold, and I require gold to beat this level. That's a nuisance. Like, that's really uncool. Give me trees. Yeah, four gold. Now we're talking. That was foolish of me. Oh, there's four of you. Alright, now we're talking. That was weak, but it's better than nothing. Still, if I could find trees... Is the commoner's grave? I'm getting the hang of it. Ah, still fell in the pit. Ah, at least there are a lot of enemies. They're lame, but they're numerous. Oh, 
Oh, I thought that would do it. Trees, trees, trees. Where can I find some trees? Or, I don't know about skeletons, but... Yeah, I mean, I hear a skeleton, but like, I don't know how much they drop. The trees drop. The trees are generous. I really love that they use the spider shield, though. That still hurts. And that was no drop. That's weak. Gravestone. Four gold. Oh, be still my heart. Gravestone. Four gold. That's it. And Pit City. Jeez, this place is a death trap. And it's laggy. Well, not really laggy. It's just the frame rate just went to hell. Wow, how do I navigate this place? I guess I have to walk all the way around. Gravestone. And we got two skeletons. Let's go. Watch out for spikes. Ugh. How come you get to walk into the poison pit? And I can't believe I actually connected with that attack. Level increases, baby. Four gold. Oh, are you kidding? Another oh my god, I could sell a knight sword now. Ladies and gentlemen. Where's that shop? I am way off the beaten path now. I am on the opposite end of the map. Ugh, but I can make this work. I can make this work. And this is the wrong way, I know, but yeah, there's a mummy. <laughs> I deserve that. Four gold. Oh, and a skeleton. This is a, a kind of a dangerous area. Seven gold, hey! Three gold, not great. What a dangerous area. And what is this? Oh, it's just stairs. I'm just gonna back away. Well, I have 1,554 gold. Eh? All right, let's see if I can get out of here. Um, I am way, way off the beaten path right now. I gotta leave. And even when I sell, I don't think that's gonna cover it. One gold from a freaking spooky, scary skeleton. That's great. But here's the tunnels. I'm doing something right. Oh. Ow. 14 gold. Better than what the freaking skeletons give, and now I'm back in the familiar-ish tunnels. There we go. I hope this sword is worth something. Uh, yeah, just keep going. Man, if this game were on PC, you could totally, like, label stuff on the map. But it isn't, so I can't. Southeast. Ah, oh, yeah, this might be, no, this is east. And this is more like it. Yeah, this is more like it. Good. Doing it. I want to continue in the southwest direction. I'm slowly learning video games. The hell? 
Oh, it's a snake. Good, good. Regular East. I'm doing it. Ah, crap. That was embarrassing. Two gold. Disappointing. Huh. <sighs> Slowly but surely, I'm actually figuring this place out. I think. Ooh, I don't know. It's the other way. But I, I knew enough to knew that. To knew that. I'm just a bit concerned by my gold. I have 1,580. That might not be quite enough. But we'll find out. Hey there, Gil. I want that other sword so bad, and I actually I can't afford it. Do you happen to have a phantom rod? If you do, I'll buy it for a good price. It's easier to find treasures if you use one. Fair enough. Uh, nice sword. 380? Oh my god, that does it. That does it. Gold cross, baby. Got it. It's no longer even available. I really feel bad, though, that I only have 160 gold because I actually really want this. I really want this. And light ring, I don't even know what that's good for. And then all this crazy armor. Yeah. Oh well. I want that I want that sword though so bad. Um, okay, so I got the cross. Consult my map on how to get back out to the church. Yeah, that's all well and good, but where's the church? Like, where did I start the game? I assume it was on the southwest part of the map in general? Oof. I assume. I can't go past this shop, so... Guess I'll just make my way out. When I get to the cross, though, I'm saving. The light ring replaces the light needle? I don't know. Or maybe it's even just an additional spell. I don't know. Interesting, uh, interesting guess though, Dragon Ace. North. This way. Oh my god, I want more gold so bad right now. I mean, even when I go to a later floor, I will be able to come back here by just making my way all the way back. But I want that sword, and I could have bought it right there. It just drives me crazy. The item I need is exorbitantly expensive. I wasn't poisoned, so I'll take it. Twelve gold. Ugh. Every little bit helps, I guess. I gotta keep reminding myself of that. Two gold? Oh my god. And now I have to go north, I think, and navigate through those crazy tunnels. Oh well. As soon as I hit a save point, that'll be it for me. This game is quite demanding in terms of getting things done and before, like between saves, there's just like a whole lot of just stuff you gotta do. The funny thing is, from according to a guide, this is apparently like one of the easier Kingfields, Kingsfields. So that makes me nervous. Like there are three more games. I wonder if the PS2 one allows you to use, uh... Ooh, not sure if West. I wonder if the PS2 one allows you to, uh, use the sticks. I have no idea if I'm going the right way here. There we go. I know I've been here before, but do I want to be here? Where was the church? That's what I want to know. I will happily take a tree, although this- Whoa, there's the spike pits. And those are scary. Like, they are- they are, like, legitimately scary. Forty-eight gold, thank you! Skeleton!
Just gotta watch out for the traps. Stay away. Okay, stay away from the spikes. He is dead. He is dead. So perhaps this was the wrong way, but I got 48 gold, which suddenly counts for a lot. There we go. So, hey, I know. Let's go south instead. Wait, no, didn't I come from that direction, though? No, I didn't. It's on the other side of that other place. Okay, east and then south. So I guess perhaps this way? Am I doing it right? I am. Cool. Yeah, this looks like a good game. So where's the church? Every little bit of gold helps, and I definitely recognize this area from when I started streaming. That's a good sign. But where is the church? That's the important thing right now. It's gotta be somewhere nearby though, right? But where, where, where? Because it's been long enough that I'm more familiar now with the, the tunnels than I am with the actual man-made part of the game. I hope I'm doing this right. What can I say? That goes into a whole network of tunnels. The church was like right at the end of a, a pathway, right? Where there was like no other place to go? Is this the church? No, this is the beginning of the entire game, but this does help to orient me somewhat. If I know I'm at the beginning of the entire game, how did I get to the church in the first place? Where does it say the church? There's the light shop. Continue down the hall, okay. Through the entranceway with the columns, good. And after that, to my left, is a tunnel. Follow it. That takes me to the light shop. No, wait, wait. Let's with the columns. Go north, and I'll see a door on my left. Maybe this is what I want. Maybe I'm right by the church right now. That was a tunnel, not so much a door. This might be it. This might be it. Oh, thank God. Now I'm scared every single time I save because of that first time. But we got it. Feels good, man. I did it. That feels freaking wonderful. So... I bought the cross... I'll give this guy the cross, and then I'll end the stream. So, you. You have found my gold cross! I don't know why this key of the dead was brought into the graveyard, or what exactly it is good for, but please take it. Hopefully it will be of some use to you in the future. Just to see if anything changes when I talk to him again. If you want to learn healing magic, you would have to ask the bishop. There is a sage on the floor below who supposedly uses water magic, but I do not know if he would teach you. Anything else, buddy? Okay. And sure enough, if I go to my inventory... Deceased key. So I got the red key, and I got the light family key. I've lost my cross, but that was the point. I now have 261 gold. I really want that better sword, though. I really do. But anyway, I got the key. I'll, I'll save one more time. Why the hell not? Okay, we did it. Ladies and gentlemen, I consider this a success. So, thank you very much for joining the stream, and have a wonderful night.